If I had one million dollars, I would probably would get like um, a small like wooden house um, near a beach, uh, and then I would have a, like a big ass computer. And I would um, I would eat a lot of um, good chocolate. Um, I don't really care about fancy cars or anything. Being a, a kid growing up with um, parents who are not together, you, um, or I at least, had to find my own little world where I felt comfortable. So I loved watching films. I'm a huge fan of Tim Burton and Guillermo del Toro. Also Miyazaki, all of his work has always been a huge inspiration for me. So that was kind of my escape from reality. When I finished high school, I was very confused about myself. And first off, I thought I was going to be a writer, like J.K. Rowling or R.L. Stein. I loved Goosebumps when I was a kid. Um, and then, and then I wanted to be a, a director. So I, after high school, I went to America and I studied film and art because those are my two greatest passions in life. And I just, I, I discovered that um, that film was. That was not my place in the creative world. This school in Denmark, um, the Danish School of Media and Journalism, they had this course called Interactive Design where they focus on animation and programming, motion graphics, and that was where I thought, okay, so I can actually mix film and art. What I really like about drawing is, and storytelling and art is that um, you can try and create a feeling, but it depends on the person that looks at it afterwards. Maybe I think and feel something when I look at this line or this shape, but other people might feel something else because they have other stories. And I think that's beautiful. I guess that's, that was what I discovered in art in the first place when I started drawing and painting um, was that I, I was in my own little bubble. I could just be myself and draw whatever I wanted. I discovered that I really want to try and inspire and um, give people an experience. <clears throat> I think like my greatest wish is to to be able to tell a story that can help someone or move someone. Mm -hmm.